Hello Fanatics, I'm Dylan Phillips and let's talk about Season 3 of Fox's Lucifer. First, we'll tell you our recap of the show, followed up by a review, and then we'll finish off with telling you if it's worth the watch. Created by Tom Kapinos, Lucifer follows the story of Lucifer Morningstar, who has decided that he has finished being his father's servant in Hell, and decides to move to Los Angeles, the City of Angels, to live on Earth and better understand humanity. So, recap time. The main story of Season 3 revolves around Lucifer's quest to discover why his wings have returned, and how they could be connected to a notorious criminal known as the Sinner Man. Chloe, Lucifer, and Dan, under the new leadership of Marcus Pierce, search for the Sinner Man, which leads the devil to a shocking discovery. Meanwhile, Maze and Linda find themselves in a love triangle with Amenadiel, as he hopes to reclaim his divinity and lost wings. As relationships are strained and lives are lost, Lucifer finally brings the battle to the Sinnerman for one final showdown of celestial beings. Lucifer is one of those unique shows that has so much going for it. It's a procedural cop drama with a serialized supernatural twist. It's based on a successful comic book series with a detailed expansive universe filled with fleshed out and flawed characters that are the definition of human nature. These characters are brought to life by the impeccable acting of this charismatic and diverse ensemble. You think with all of that on its resume that this show should be a bona fide success. The series continued to perfectly blend the elements of procedural and serialized content in the stories of this season. While dealing with the typical case of the week storylines, the characters all went through transformational arcs, with the celestial beings learning about the nature of humanity and their own self-worth. This show should have been the spiritual successor to Bones, but just like Sleepy Hollow, it didn't gain the trust of its network thanks to its supernatural elements. Lucifer and Chloe are one of the most dynamic couples on television, as their personalities are different enough that they're able to fit together so perfectly. Ellis's performance as the title character is especially noteworthy, as he feels like the physical embodiment of a sly, charismatic devil figure. However, as was previously mentioned, the entire cast deliver phenomenal performances as well, with every character in this season leaving an impactful mark, showing the strong writing and direction of this series. So, with the thoughts heard, here's our final word. This season of Lucifer takes this supernatural cop drama to new heights, as the devil spreads his angelic wings in search of answers to some of the Bible's biggest questions. With an immersive world, thought-provoking themes, and a jaw-dropping cliffhanger, this series ends on a high note, leaving the audience craving a world where the devil returns. Between its characters, between its characters and consistently thrilling narrative, this show has only gotten better since its pilot. So I'm going to say it's definitely worth the watch. And that's our recap. And that's our re and that's our recap and review of season 3 of Lucifer. If you've seen it, what did you think and was it worth the watch? Let us know in the comments below. I'm Dylan Phillips and thanks for watching. If you like this video and you want to see more, hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Check out our latest Worth the Watch video where we recap and review Season 2 of Superior Donuts. Don't forget to follow us on our social media. And until next time, fanatics, keep it real.